Hello, this is Robert Maniki. I'm continuing installation of Oracle 10G Rack on CentOS 4 and using VMware. In last session, we prepared the uh, Linux uh, server configuration and pre downloaded the Oracle cluster applications as well, software. Um, let's get in. Let's continue um, and run the cluster verification. Um, it's the pre run to make sure that we have everything set up in a correct way. Uh, that We should be hopefully running uh, the cross verifications pre uh, CRS install will tell us that we haven't got we have configured everything fine and uh, we haven't got any errors at all. But if you have any errors, we'll try to fix it. Mind you, everything is fixable. So. Looks good so far. Oh, fail, fail. Uh, what is it failing? Uh, three failure. Okay. You know when we started, I said that uh, I will follow. Uh, Oracle base instructions. It's possible there's um, distro was a different distro altogether to the one that I have actually downloaded, and our distro obviously hasn't got these particular RPMs. Just to um, verify that, let's open up a terminal and looking at root. Think up to date, most moments should all grip just to get the names. Compact the slip. TDC, I think that should be enough. More, oh, okay, more than likely, we have actually got them installed, but it's slightly different version. And Cluster is going to specifically look for this particular version, otherwise, it's going to fail. Um, it's not a big deal, we can go and find these ones and install them. So let's pick up. Is this the first one? I've got three failures. One, two, three. DC. I got well, this one is a failure as well. But I remember. Yeah. So let's go and find these three RPMs and we install them. Um, control tab to give us a new. Just go search Google some RPM sometime. Um, RPM Finder or something would be a good site to be on. Maybe we just go in here. Yes, this is good. That's the first one. Let's 
second one we want is this one. This one is development. Um, I'm just picking up as it comes. Uh, I hope that they will be okay. Dependencies, okay. Compact GCC is required. Um, screen is blank. But we have. Uh, maybe we need to do compact GCC as well. Dependencies we need. Um, okay. What I will do, I will pause the video and I'll find out exactly what it is and come back and tell you as well. Hang on a second. Okay, um, I had to download another RPM package and they are installed now. I had to uninstall this particular uh, version of um, library too for the rest of them to go through. Let's check the cluster there again. Um, that this time it will satisfy everything. Hopefully we are not going to get any more errors. There is a fail there as well. Missing. Ah, okay. So we need to install exactly the same thing on Rack 2 as well. Um, I need to copy and follow the exactly same procedure over there. Um, what I will do, I will stop the video here, copy across, and um, copy the RPMs across and install it on Rack 2 and we come back and in next session we'll get everything sorted and um, we install, we start actually the installation of the Oracle and this is Robert Malikian installing Oracle Rack 10G on a CentOS 4 using VMware. Bye.